Oh no. Is it in his eyes? Maybe. <laughs> Specifically, is it his case? If you're messy about it, yeah. <laughs> oh, it's in his eyes. <laughs> um. <laughs> Do you want a clap or shall yeah. I? Um, you clap. Three, two, one. Come on now. I've not even got headphones on and I knew that was spectacular. <laughs> It was great. Does it, did it come across well? Yes, it came across Thank very well. You. You're a credit to yourself and your family. <laughs> An upstanding member of society. I didn't say that. <laughs> a sitting down member of society. There we go. <laughs> Thank you. Um, do you want to start? Shall I start? What do you fancy? Well, I thought you had a bit. Oh, it's a bit later on. Oh, it's a bit later Don't on. Don't spoil the bit Sorry. later on. <laughs> oh, a warning to listeners. There will be bits in quiz come by. <laughs> but they're all off the cuff and they're definitely not pre-planned. <laughs> I see. Would you like me to signpost the bit when it's on its way? <laughs> just to me? <laughs> well, just like physically. A special signal yeah. that a bit is coming. Yeah. I would appreciate that every time. Because if <laughs> I don't know you're doing a bit, I get very stressed. <laughs> um, if you are on the Patreon... Do Patreon, a safe word dog. for bits. <laughs> <laughs> Patreon.com forward slash queers. You can see us. Yes. Um, I'm in drag this time. I'm not. But Well, we're all born naked. And if you're not, that's a problem. <laughs> <laughs> then... Your get mom, your, get mom. your mom down to the hospital. <laughs> she needs checking up. Your mum was cheating on you with a branch of Matalan. <laughs> on you? <laughs> on your dad. <laughs> Not a great bit, was it? <laughs> <laughs> good bit, bad me. bit. <laughs> um, a good bit coming up. I'm I'm happy with the bit that I've planned. Okay. And it is quite silly. <laughs> okay. Um yeah. How would you like me to signpost the bit? Um Give you a big wink. <laughs> Yeah, okay. Big wig. Or like tap your nose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll do something physical. Okay. Um which you can see on Patreon. Yeah. Um because we do video episodes. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I think you clamber up onto the chair. Bits, bits, bits. Warning. <laughs> this bit is approaching. <laughs> Vehicle is reversing. I'm very, very warm. Mentally All reversed. Right. <laughs> Yeah. Do you want to start? Do you want to do hello? Sure. Do you want to do the hello? Hello. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I'll do it. <laughs> Bits. I'm Kate LaBelle. And I'm Kate Butch. And this is Quiz Gone By, the show we talk about nostalgic film and TV and try to work out if that's what made us queer. And today. And today. We're not doing it. We're cont- <laughs> containing that now. <laughs> the whole episode. <laughs> Um, today, we are, um, speaking of Patreon. Oh, yes. Um, we're, we're doing a, a poll answer. Yes. Um, we decided to do something Disney-ish. Because we haven't done Disney in Not really. We, don't, we, we haven't really done, like, did, a classic animation. Yeah, in all We've time. done Oliver and Company. Yes. Anast- Aristocats. Yes. Anastasia's all my birthday ones. Iffy. Um, did we do Brother Bear? Yes, we did. And maybe that was it. That's a... An interesting smorgasbord. <laughs> yes. It's like a port wine in a charcuterie. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't mean port wine. Port cheese. Port wine cheese, yes. Port wine cheese. Got it from the big Tesco. Yeah. Not sponsored, but could be. But interesting. I I never had a port a port wine cheese until. It's all right, isn't it? It's fine. It's not life changing. It doesn't really taste that much of port. Just taste of cheese. You might as well soak some cheese in port. And I would. I'd do it again. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I'd have gotten away with it. <laughs> Um, but I called the police. Uh, <laughs> so we put it to our patrons. Um, yes. What would you like us to do? We gave them many options. I'm going to tell them the options because I feel like people will be angry and it might encourage them to participate. Um, so we had Little Mermaid. My favourite. Hercules. Fit. My joint favourite, I think. Oh, big favourite. That came third. Can you believe? Emperor's New Groove came second. Eartha Kit. Yzma. Ah. Uh, I've not just cat bonanza. Sensible seventy four, um, and then uh, Tarzan got no votes, which I think is fair. But he spends the whole thing in loincloth. Mm. We've got a lot of lesbians. We've got on a, lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of lesbians. Rosie O'Donnell, what is a gorilla? Oh, you told me about this last time. I, yeah, I think I've never seen there's, the whole thing. There's a thing. genderqueer gorilla. Okay, but you people weren't ready for that. Instead, you wanted a genderqueer human. <laughs> Trans, 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 yes. trans. Because this week we are reviewing Mulan. 
Oh, what's that then? Look at me. Oh. I will never pass. I won't. No. <laughs> Do you want to talk about... Mulan? No, <laughs> about what happened on Twitter. Oh, I got told I was doing woman face. Yes, it was very funny. But I'm currently drafting some stand-up about it, so... Yeah. Come and see me do stand-up and maybe and you'll see some woman face. I investigated because I was like, surely this massive feminist icon who's telling you you're doing woman face. Cheshire chap on Twitter. Yes. Um, surely he is going to be, ju- his entire account is just going to be like repro rights, FGM activism. Mm-hmm. Turns out, no, porn and turf shit. Turfy and porn, turfy and porn. Chugging along on the old timeline. <laughs> and then likes got hidden on Twitter. The day after. So I think I think you got into a fight with Elon Musk. Maybe. I think that's what happened. And I'd do it again. Yeah. <laughs> um, but yes, thank you for everyone who leapt to my defence, which is very kind. Yeah. Oh, oh, I've just got a DM. It's Cheshire Chap. It's Cheshire Chap. I put myself on bloody do not disturb. Come on, please. He called me a cunt. And to be fair, <laughs> he's got me there. He's bloody got me there. Do not disturb. Don't worry. Sit back down because I've not got any corset or pads on. (laughs) (laughs) Don't look at my shame. Um, But we're not talking about woman face. We're talking about man face today. (laughs) Sure, yeah. Sure. (laughs) Which doesn't really get a look in, does it? No. No. They get all like, you cut off your beautiful boobs. I love your beautiful (laughs) boobs. Delicious tits. Oh, titties. I love them. Where have they gone? Can I have them? Can I have them? (laughs) Please, for me. <laughs> and got mixed there, swinging them around her head. Oh, they didn't like that, did they? Did they not? On oh, cause, because they thought... That it was wait, um, um, a, cis a cis man, man. doing woman face. Yeah. Doing and then tra- Mick, trans man face. Yeah, got Mick was like, I've, I've never, I never get more gender affirmed than by turfs. <laughs> it's very funny. Um, <sighs> so going back to 1998... Yes. Um, to a, a sensible length. One thing that Disney's got going for it, <clears throat> it does a 90 minute film. A sensible yeah. one hour 40. It might be kind of an evil capitalist corporation. Yeah. However. But trans icon Mulan. Also, about a quarter of that time length was credits. Yes. It uh, was Christina Aguilera doing yeah. <laughs> reflection. The ideal amount of credits, I reckon. <laughs> She Shut had a lot shit. of people. I get so excited when I, I drag my little mouse along the line to see when the credits start and it's it's a decent <laughs> chunk. I d- yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm the same. Yeah. <laughs> like, oh, I thought it was a two hour film. It's an hour and 40. Yeah. Because it had a lot of CGI. Mm-hmm. I love that in a film. Yes, love that. Um, If you've not seen it. What? Eleanor hadn't seen it. What? How? She lived in France. I don't know. They must have had Moulin. Le Moulin, Moulin Rouge. Le Moulin. <laughs> Le Moulin Rouge. That's great. Um, we did see Moulin, Moulin Rouge at the vaults. We which did. Which was like a drag oh, spectacular. Really fun, Sicky Moonlight. Sorry? Sicky Moonlight ah, was in it. She sure. Very good. I don't really remember. How, it was is good, it dinner at a show? A dinner a show. I do remember the dinner. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely. Lovely dinner. Um, I watch this all the time. What? <laughs> wow. <laughs> what a concept. Mm, yes. <laughs> I definitely had it on video. It wasn't one of my top ones. Okay. What was your top one? Little Mermaid. Uh, okay. Ursula. Return to the Sea. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah. We shall be. I love a Disney sequel. Me too. Do you know um, Tom Tuck, the stand-up? Yes. He had like a radio show that was called Tom Tuck Goes Direct to VHS or something. Was it just about sequels? And it was about different ones uh-huh. and the first episode was about Disney sequels <gasps> and it's amazing that sounds great his bit about Lion King 3 <laughs> is... <laughs> is that co that's Lion King 2 Lion King 3 is a Kuna Matata Lion King 1 and a half uh-huh. um, where it's yes. Rosencrantz and Guildenstern are dead yeah um, it's great he yeah, goes on a rant about people watching it in the cinema why like because they, they it's filmed it's like they're in a cinema and then people keep turning up and there's silhouettes. And it's like, it's like, no, they wouldn't bring him here. It's Mickey. <laughs> it's great. It's great. Oh, wow. Yeah. That sounds great. It's, would recommend, I think it's on YouTube, maybe. Mm. Or BBC Signs. Signs? Show you around. Maybe play you a signed. BBC Signs. 
Do you have a house to the tide or the country? I love that. Me too. Uh, <laughs> but we're not here to talk about Tim Curry. It's but I really wish I was. warm. It is warm, but we can't open a window because loud. Just. Oh, thank you. Is that good? Is yeah, that, that's that great. A good waft. It's a lovely waft. <laughs> Show us your waft. Yay, Mulan. Yay, waft. You can see it on the Patreon. <laughs> <laughs> um, we start off at the Great Wall of China, would you believe? Because we're in China. And the Huns have invaded. There's the nearest all bar one. <laughs> <laughs> the Huns. They've got a Molotov cocktail made out of tequila rose. <laughs> <laughs> That's what they did in Moulin Rouge, wasn't it? In Moulin Rouge. Oh, did they? Okay, the Huns. Oh, love that. Every time. That <laughs> yeah. bad clicks all around, sorry. Thank you, the Huns. Mm. <laughs> um, I just want to say, also at the start, this film is hot. Like, everyone is hot yeah the first soldier is hot the hawk is hot the shirtless man with a knife is hot explains by exes it all they're <laughs> all hot no one isn't hot no Maybe one like isn't... the emperor's aide just because he's a bit of a cunt okay he's not hot yeah but he's also like the queer villain queer coded villain character yes. they, they always put in in disney yeah yeah because they've got a straight main villain yeah who is shan yu not to be confused with shan yu the dancing cult Oh, yes. I love that as a concept. You yeah. know, Auntie Chan from Chicago. Oh, yes, she just does. like does what, like she just spins. <laughs> she just spins in the skirt. It's like, discover the magic. <laughs> it's magical. <laughs> it's a cult. About, yeah. I, did I tell you about, I think I talked about it on the pod, getting talked to by a cult person? Yes. Yeah, on the tube. This girl was like, would you like to come to our Bible practice? And I was like, hmm no no not on a good day but especially not on the tube <laughs> on the northern line i don't uh, think yeah it's got enough screaming as it is yeah um there's lots of grappling hooks and they're on invading and someone raises yes. an alarm i don't want to be a history girly right off the top but this is fifth century ad we weren't even mott and bailey in and they've got the great wall of china what's mott and bailey Isn't mott and that, bailey the police drama with no um, mott and bailey the Saran Jones. It. Castle on it. I'm thinking of Scott and Bailey. <laughs> <laughs> Year seven history, babe. Mott and Bailey. Well. Sutton who? <laughs> Doctor who? And other... I would say Sutton what, personally. <laughs> <But> <laughs> I'm scared that it's not recording. I'm going to go and have a look. Go and have a look. Tell us more about China. Um. Oh, I did look it up. Um... So Wiki it's says, fine. Wiki says this is the Han Dynasty, but everywhere else says it's the Northern Wei Dynasty. We're all having fun. It's, it's... If we're laughing, we're learning. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, she's not called Far Mulan, is she? She's called like Hua Mulan. Oh, in the original. Genuinely. Yeah. In the legend. Yeah. And they where well, they did the re the live action, didn't they? Which is very controversial. I kind of want to watch it because apparently it's terrible. Well, apparently it's very controversial. Why and controversial? they don't even sing. What? Um, because like they. The stuff about Hong Kong and things, and the main actress is a bit of a oh. a wrong one. <laughs> is it like, is it bad as in, oh, it's bad, it's fun, you should watch, or it's bad as in, like, oh, you shouldn't support it? I think there were there were lots of calls to not watch it. Okay, but if you've got the subscription anyway, <laughs> you know, who's going to stop you? Not us. I'm not. No. <laughs> we're busy. Asked. We're doing this. <laughs> There's a big, um, the beacons are lit, Gondor calls for aid. Yes. It's yes, great. Yes. And the animation with the flickering flames. And it, it when the flames are flickering, when mm-hmm. the beacons are lit, the people behind get all fuzzy, like if they're standing behind oh, a fire. I love it. It's good. It's the Disney Renaissance, isn't it? <sighs> yeah. And you can tell. Peak, peak animation, I think. Mm. Yeah. Very nice. Mm-hmm. Very lovely. I liked Pocahontas, which are, again, problematic, but. Yeah. I think I only watched it maybe once. Raccoon. And lovely songs. And a talking tree. Yeah. Colours of the wind. Just yeah. around the river bend. Yeah. My fave. Hmm. And fun, like, interestingly done. Animated. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. I've not really seen Hunchback of Notre Dame. I was about to ask you about that. Me neither. I think I watched it when I was ill or something and I uh, don't really remember. Fair enough. <laughs> Slipping in and out of consciousness. <laughs> Um, Mulan is here. Here she is. Oh, we, sorry. We also oh. get um, Shan Yu's brilliant line where they're like, now all of China knows you're here. And he's like, perfect. 
He's cunty. He's cunty. I love him. Oh, and the Emperor's Aid. I do remember this from like the trailers at the start of Disney videos. Um, oh, yeah. Mum, the picture's all funny. I can't hear it. Yeah. Um, when he goes, the Huns have invaded China. I remember yes. him doing that. Yeah. The little little faggy aid. Fun fact, faggy aid. <laughs> I should, I... A delicious glass of faggy aid. <laughs> Um, he is the old, the actor is the oldest star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. 93. Is it, is it him who was in Everything Everywhere? Oh, I don't know. I think he's the granddad in Everything Everywhere. Every, is he? Uh, James, James Hong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, cool. He's a big nice. deal. Yeah. They've got at least three Chinese people in this. I think it's more than that. They've got a lot of Japanese people in this. Oh, no. And Leia Salonga is from the Philippines. Okay. And also Harvey Feierstein. Yes. <laughs> Why not? Why not? Doing mask. <laughs> doing bro. Do get your cock out, Harvey Feierstein. Yes. <laughs> uh, but we'll get to that. Yes. Um, Mulan. Yes. Is here with her dog, whose name is Little Brother. Yeah. I won't think about it. Mm-hmm. Um, she's so gay. She's so gay. She's got initiative. She's inventive. She makes a little thing to. Get her dog to do her chores for her. Stick some... Woman in STEM. Yeah. A bone in front of him and then... Uh... Um, she's getting ready to visit the matchmaker. Now, I hope that the matchmaker isn't played by a celebrity. I'd, I'll be very cross if oh. so. I'll be abs- I'll be livid. Okay. But we'll, when we meet the matchmaker, we might talk about that. Okay. Um... The horse is fit. <laughs> The horse is fit. The tables. <laughs> they are returning. <laughs> yeah. You're right. Um, I'm not wrong. And to be honest, so is the cricket. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Yeah. But would you fuck Mushu? No. No. The horse, though. <laughs> the horse. The horse would treat you right. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, the grandma has the lucky cricket. Yes. And she's testing how lucky it is by walking mm. through traffic. Yes. Fair enough. Yeah. You would, wouldn't you? Yeah. But I, I, I love the grandma. The grandma's great. And we get the fucking song. Honour to us all. Oh, is that your like favourite song? I love it. I, I, most of the songs. These songs are banging. Banging? I don't think there's a single bad one. No. But this is probably my least favourite one, actually. Oh, of I, all of them. I like it. Yeah, it's good. It's great. Beads um, of jade for they, beauty. The assistants are camp. Camp. They're giving kind of drag queen. Yeah. Yeah. And the tiny waist they... Yes. Yes. This is drag. If, if Chapel Road's doing drag, then this is drag. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. It's great. It's great. It's so good. You'll bring honour to us all. I have a vivid memory of being so obsessed with the glossiness of the lipstick mm. and how just it just slides on i wanted to be that lipstick i, was, I just the makeup trickery uh, in this film <laughs> we'll get to it <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah if only all makeup could be like this yes um i loved i loved all the girls i remember watching the scene over and over again and all the girls with their different hairstyles yes and they, or when they line up you see yeah. all their different i just, i love it <sighs> and it, it pans along on the queue yes yeah I love that. Lovely, yes. It's a banger. Ancestors, hear my plea. Help me not to make a fool of me. And do not uproot my family. When he goes, keep my father standing tall. And it's like the... Yeah. I don't know what that cadence is yeah. in the music. but Oh, because her dad is um, uh, an ex-military... War hero. War hero. Yes, that is context. Um, and then... It's time to meet the matchmaker. Busting out all over. Now, Miriam, can you just... Can you come here for a second, please? Miriam, where were you on January the 6th? <laughs> 1998. <laughs> Was that your bit? <laughs> no. Miriam, what, what the fuck have you been up to? I, don't speak to us like that, young lady. <laughs> Miriam, you've been off doing films, have you? In lots of films. You've been lots of films, lots haven't of you? Lots of films. I didn't realise it was her. Harry Potter? No, I've never heard of it. No. No, sorry. <laughs> um, didn't realise it was her until she started screaming. And I was like, that's our <laughs> Miriam. That's Miriam. <laughs> until her tush was on fire, I had no clue. <laughs> she loves a burning arse. She loves a burning Burning arse. tush. Burning bush. That's my next. Ah, oh, beard on fire. Burning butch. That's a Eddie's old bit. 
Eddie Susie. Susie Eddie. <laughs> And also with you. Yes. Um, it's Miriam. Oh, Miriam. She she says that Mulan's shit. Uh, she's too skinny. Same. Yeah. Um, and that she has to do some reciting and tea pouring to see how good yes. she is at being a woman. Yes. And Mulan is um, oh, good. cheating on her exams. Oh, yeah. She's, got, she's written on a, her, her arm. Yeah. The one thing I don't find attractive about Mulan is cheating on her exams. <laughs> I remember... First year of uni, we were in that massive um, central hall. Was that is that what it's called? I didn't do exams at uni. Oh yeah, of course you didn't do a real degree. <laughs> oh sorry, history of art. <laughs> yeah, I had to write things. I wrote a play. How many pages? I can't remember, but I'll have a look for you. Okay. Um, I got eighty-one marks for that. Yes, because it was writing a script. How many marks have you got for your script? <laughs> Is this a bit? No. <laughs> Wink, if it's a bit. bit. <laughs> if it's a bit, you have to tell me. <laughs> um, I remember I was in Central Hall doing exams. There's like five different groups doing exams. Mm-hmm. The guy in front of me, I did not know, started Mulaning it, pulled up his shirt and had all his notes written on his hand. And I was like, I have to tell someone. That's illegal. That's not allowed. Did, did you? Did you tell someone? No, because the, the invisible lady was the other side. And then by the time they came round, I was like, Rrr, like back in the zone. You didn't want to get stitches. I'm fine with stitches. <laughs> I, I, oh. Oh, it might be actually something useful. <laughs> right. But I can't go looking like this. I'll tell <laughs> the story of when I got it? tonsillitis in my English literature AS level. Oh, thank God. <laughs> <laughs> um, so it was, um, the year was last year. Because I'm 17. And um, I uh, had to uh, do English literature A level, AS level. I didn't have to. I was doing the exam. And um, uh, we were doing Brian Friel's Dancing at Lunasa. I don't know if you've ever, ever read it. And also I think William Blake's Songs of Innocence and Experience. Very, very good um, poems about sexual awakenings. Um, relevant. Oh, my God. We're a literary podcast now. Look at that. Haven't I done well? They're taking their time, aren't they? wonder what they've got. What is it? Is it something nice for me? I like inviting my friends around to my house and they make them answer the door for me because I'm, I'm just too gorgeous and stunning. Oh, that's, yes, that's the thing that I need. That's a shit tagline. <laughs> well, well okay. I hope the microphone didn't catch that. Um, <laughs> thank you for doing that. It's meant to arrive yesterday. I think maybe a few weeks ago, but hey, yeah. Um, <laughs> I just told well, oh, I got I got Todd's lights in the middle of it, and then um, that's it. I realised that? that we are a literary podcast because I was talking about my English A level, talking about um, William Blake's Songs of Innocence and Experience, which is about um, poems about sexual awakenings. <gasps> We're basically yeah. William Blake. Sure, I'll take it. What else you done? Tiger, Tiger, Burning Bright. I thought it was that, but yeah. I didn't want to sound silly. Get your cock out tonight. <laughs> Sexual awakening. Sexual awakening. <laughs> anyway, um, the ink is rubbing off yes. onto Miriam, and she gets like a little beard. And the cricket and is chilling in the hot tub. Yeah. Um, oh, in the soup. In the soup. Um, and she's like, you dickhead. Yes. You fucking twat. You'll never bring your family on her. Yeah. You may look like a bride. But you'll never bring your family on her. That's nasty, Miriam. It's nasty. It's not. It's uncalled for. D- Actually, it was fairly called for. Fe- yeah. Relatively <laughs> called for. Um, but. Ma- oh. Oh. Oh, no, you go. Well, I'm, I'm skipping to the next bit where she's all sad. Yeah. It's it's time. It's, it's time. <laughs> Sing. I used Sing. to. I used to rewatch this bit and cry and not know why. <laughs> now I know. Now I know. <laughs> It's because you want makeup wipes. It'll take off exactly half of your makeup at once, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Yes. That's why. Yes. It's reflection. <sighs> Who is that girl I see staring straight back at me? Banger. Lovely. It's a banger. This song. And it's um. So Leia Salonga is the singing voice, mm-hmm. and I adore her. Yes, she was in. Uh, Miss Saigon was her first big thing. Oh, 
But she was in a recent thing. She was in Sometimes Old Friends once. that I saw recently. Once, once on this island. Yes, once on this island. Um, I saw her do Mrs. Lovett, which was amazing. Really? Not not in the Sometime review. Oh, okay, I She only cool. did that one song. But I was like, she'd be amazing. Did she do Splashy? <laughs> She did not. Oh. <laughs> Thank God. Okay. All right. <laughs> not got a lot of relatives that are going to come pocket around Pocking after him. Pocking around after him. <laughs> um, she's great. Love her. Yeah. And she's also, I think, the singing voice of Jasmine. Yes. I think. Oh, mm. Yes. 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 Um, the father does some fathering for once. <laughs> Father's fathering. Yes. Um, um, I, th- I do think the reflection, this one, is better yeah. than the Christina one. Oh, yeah, I mean, yeah. Christina's Is good. Is that controversial? I think people are, like, obsessed with the Christina one. No. She did another one for the remake. Okay. Tr- truth, beauty, honour, love, something. Okay. Live, laugh, love, which was quite good. Okay. Just yeah. Shout out for Christina there. Uh, who's this? Come around the corner. It's Rishi Sunak here to conscript you. <laughs> <laughs> Would you do national service? No! Fair enough. Would you? If there was like a, like an entertaining the troops kind of, not to Vicky Vivacious it, but um, <laughs> if I had to. <laughs> you could have gone Marilyn Monroe, but no, Vicky Vivacious. <laughs> I'd Marlena Dietrich it. Ooh. I'd be like, oh. Hello, boys. Hello, Bong. I'm not interested in any of you. The lily of the lamb. No, but then I'd be like, I am interested in all of you. Yes. I know, it's been ever so long for you all. Get your cock out for your country. Um, yeah, no, I, I think I wouldn't probably. Dicks out for your country. Dicks out for your country. <sighs> wouldn't really interest you, would it? No. <laughs> They're all much more muchness. Yeah. Yeah. It's been so long since I could tell. <sighs> um, yes, uh, it's announced that the Huns have invaded mm-hmm. and that one man from every family must fight. Yes. Hunger Games in it. Yeah. Uh, Mulan's dad is the only man in the family. Yes. For now. Send the horse. <laughs> Send the sexy horse. Yeah. Maybe it's a girl horse. <laughs> Gorse, no. I'm on board. <laughs> I was on board before, but now I'm, I'm saddled up. <laughs> um. <laughs> Got your feet in them stirrups. <laughs> That's, That's how you ride us. <laughs> That's what my doctor said to me. Silly. Um, yeah, he gets out his armour and his sword. And then he, does he cut himself? Accidentally? He's proper knackered. Yeah. He's a knackered old man. Yeah. It's, that is stupid. You're really stupid. What a waste of a, a life and a uniform. Well, that's that's the army, isn't it? Well, yeah, but yeah. Like, he was made in Carlisle. <laughs> <laughs> He's knackered in Carlisle and he shouldn't be in the army. Have I told you I know the person who... Well, I know of the person who did that, who made that advert. <gasps> yeah. I w- Crazy. I still haven't done it yet. I wanted to do a lip sync mashup of it with <laughs> Salute by Little Mix. Oh, my God. <laughs> Wouldn't that Vicky, be Vicky would cream herself. <laughs> She'd be thrilled. Ladies are like... It would be very ironic. Yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. No, but she, does, she doesn't share my sense of humour famously. So. Um. <laughs> um, he gets mad at Mulan. Yeah. He's like, know your place. Well, my place is trans. <laughs> yeah. And she has a transition montage. <laughs> I got goosebumps. <laughs> she cut her hair off? Come on. Chills. <laughs> no chills for you? I was like, <laughs> I've seen it all before. <laughs> all right. And the horse... Trans people are dime a dozen, really, aren't they? <laughs> <laughs> the horse freaks out because yeah. he doesn't know it's her. And then he's like, oh, okay, okay, we see. Or is the horse transphobic? Oh. Do you still want to fuck that horse? Any port in a store. <laughs> that horse is the Cheshire chap of feudal China. <laughs> no! <laughs> um, um, the family's absolutely gutted that she's gone. And the grandma's yes. like, I'm, I'm going to sort this. I'm going to pray to the ancestors. Yes. And we meet Mushu. Yes, because they awaken the little tiny dragon. Yes. Um, and it's Eddie Murphy doing bits. Yes. Um, I was like, this is just donkey. It's just, don- I thought that too. It might be that I've watched Shrek a lot more than I have Mulan. Yeah. It is just donkey. It's his original donkey. Yeah, it's his audition. It's his audition for donkey. Donkey audition. Um, 
he's a demoted family guardian. What did Mushu do? <laughs> what? I thought there would be like a, a moment. Yeah. Where he'd be like, oh, I was looking after someone and then they fucking died. Yeah. Didn't no. really get that. No. No. Um, Imagine if he's like, yeah, he's a murderer. <laughs> <laughs> I just meant through like negligence as a oh. guardian, but um But like imagine yeah, your family guardian who's looking after you and you're like, oh fuck, you you're a wrong and a proper bad one. <laughs> um Eddie Murphy has he been in a film recently? I feel okay. like I haven't seen him. He was very good in Dream Girls. I think he I think he chewed all the early two thousand scenery mm. up and they were like, Leave some for the rest of you. But on the other hand, he's not Robin Williams. No. And he's trying to be. Um, He's trying to do genie bits. I thought you have not done nearly enough cocaine (laughs) to be Robin Williams. Um, Okay, I need you to rank Mm -hmm. Robin Williams, Eddie Murphy, Jim Carrey. Just as people, not as as these. Jim Carrey, rock bottom. Me too. Thank you. I just. I've never seen um. Ace Ventura. That's transphobic. It has a transphobic ending. Yes. Right? Yes. Um, but people will still be like, "Oh, I know it's bad, but it's my favorite film." I'm like, "Have you not grown up? Have you not? Have you not, <laughs> not seen, seen other films? There are other films. You've not seen Barb and Star go to Vista Del Mar. Clearly not. Uh. <laughs> Otherwise, it'd be their third film. <laughs> Someone sent me uh, a Twitter thread about Michael Owen, the rugby player, football player. Close He's enough. only seen like seven films, which which are, and it's like, it's like <laughs> melancholia. It's like <laughs> Shawshank, female trouble, um, uh, Star Wars, hundred and twenty days of Sodom, Jurassic Park, and he was forced to watch Jurassic Park three times, and he was asked which is your favourite of those. He's like none of them. What an interesting man. <laughs> what does he like? Um, I think it uh, cheating on his wife, I believe. Oh. <laughs> Soliciting nudes by saying, what was it? Come on then, slide him over. <laughs> to quote Michael Owen. Yeah. Come on then, slide him over. Come on then. To me, not to get to... I think you, don't, was... you don't want the nudes, do you? No, I'm alright. I... I'm alright. I take, yeah, I take a nude. <laughs> Please don't. <laughs> no. No, no, not of myself. I'd accept one. <laughs> yeah. Absolutely not of myself. No one wants that. Fuck me. No, <laughs> if they hacked my phone, they'd be like, keep it. <laughs> keep it. Um, um, I love the ancestors. Yes. They have like an American Gothic moment. Yeah, one of them's got no head. I love when he's like, my children never caused any trouble. They were all acupuncturists. <laughs> well, we can't all be acupuncturists. <laughs> No, your great, great granddaughter had to be a cross dresser. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> great. Um, um, Mushu wants to go and help, but oh no, because the last time he helped, it was the decapitation. Oh, is That's that what why, he did? That doesn't yeah. seem like it's his fault. Get over it. You're a yeah. ghost. You're still here. Um, but he's sent to awaken the great stone dragon, who's the one that's meant to help. But he accidentally yes. breaks it. Yes. So he has to pretend to be the great stone dragon. Yes, and the cricket goes along too. He says, oh, I'm doomed. All because Miss Man decided to take a drag show on the road. <laughs> Miss Man. <laughs> it's very, like, fruity. Yeah, very fruity. For a, a 90s Disney it's film. It's me when all my queer friends go to Edinburgh. <laughs> <laughs> I am Miss Man. <laughs> the podcast will cease. Please, Miss Man was my father. <laughs> Um, Shan Yu is threatening people and he has this bit where he pulls off this hood and it's so drag king. <laughs> it's so drag king. He does a reveal. <gasps> it's hot. Uh, he's he's like, so masculine that it goes full circle to drag king. It's amazing. That, that's a very incisive assessment, actually. Yeah. yeah. He's hot. <laughs> <laughs> and he's like, take a message to the emperor that I'm back in business yeah and there's two of them he's like well only one person needs to send the message yes and then he kills the other one how many does it take to send a message <laughs> how many beans make five what a bean and a bean and a half bean and a half bean and a bean and a bean how many beans make five i don't know what this is and i don't want to learn <laughs> this is one of my mum's bits <laughs> okay a be- oh, oh fuck, fuck off, off. 
It's your mummy, some of the... <laughs> I'll talk about my beans. She heard you were talking shit. Am I getting that? Yes, please. Okay. Might be one of my Victoria Wood books. <laughs> really unnecessary. But um, um, what should I talk about now? Um, I'm just going to sing Reflection for you. Look at me, I will never pass for a perfect bride. I've started too low. Or a perfect daughter, can it be? I'm not meant to play this part. Now I see that if I were truly to be myself, I would break my family's heart. Do 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 everybody who is that girl I see staring straight back at me? Why is my head going in my mouth so much? Where the fuck is Caitlin Powell? Have they been abducted? Maybe it's some Christians waiting at the door. Caitlin, where the fuck are you? What's going on? Come back to your friend Kathy Bastards. I just heard the door close. I, can't, I bet they've got a story to tell. How exciting. Everyone has a story that needs to be told. What? What? That's empty handed. Oh, fair enough. For downstairs? Yeah. Oh, yeah. No, no. For, the next for next door? Yeah. Oh. Sorry. Inside? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, I need to collect something from next door, so. Ah. You could do a, an exchange. Mm, they're very nice, next door. They love me. Did you do an exchange? What? To, to a different country. Oh, no. Uh, did you? To a Spanish one. Where did you go? Zaragoza. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's, like, it's like in the middle of the desert near Barcelona. Was it at the same time as your Spanish person? No. Oh. The Spanish person, Raquel. <laughs> <laughs> this is a Raquel call-out pod. Yeah, honestly, it is. She, uh, she got me wearing eyeliner. I think I fancied Raquel. Anyway, <laughs> <laughs> I'm realising things. But um, the last like two days she was at mine, she started using, like she was, there was like a toilet next to her bedroom. And then my my bedroom was like down the hall. Mm-hmm. There was a different toilet. And she started using my toilet. And I was like, what's going on here? And she's like, oh, nothing. I just like your toilet. <laughs> I was like, okay. Um, turns out she'd been putting like, sanitary products down the loo and when it started like filling up she didn't stop it just kept going like to frame you no like just because i think because she didn't know but also we provided a bin Um... we weren't monsters um and then she just left and didn't say anything didn't even say oh i'm sorry i've blocked the toilet how bizarre yes what's spanish for toilet Toiletta. Is it? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. I uh, don't know. Uh, I'm not looking at that. Mulan is practicing her man voice, and the horse is not it's impressed. It's giving mass lesbian on TikTok. It's giving so like. <laughs> uh, and Mushu reveals himself with flames and shadows, yes. and somehow his eyes are transparent. Yeah, she's like a lizard. <laughs> <laughs> Dragon, not lizard. I don't do that tongue thing. <laughs> And She's the delicious <laughs> Miss Mandarin. Mandarin. Mm. Are you watching All Stars? You're not watching All Stars, are you? Are you? I'm watching All Stars available on Wow Presents Pro Plus. Ah, I see. I'm obsessed with Chanel. I am too. I'm, 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 I'm behind on All Stars. Okay. How many episodes have there been? Too many. <laughs> Chanel has deserved Chanel. one or two wins, I think. Is Angeria doing well? Um... I love Angeria. Not really. Oh, who's going to win? She's getting blocked. I think either Roxy or Got Mick are going to oh, win. Oh, well, Roxy. Or Plastic. I think they're really pushing. Plastic can act now. Okay. She Allegedly. Allegedly. She's making RuPaul laugh. That's, that's all the game. That's, that's the game. 
And we can't all be winners. <laughs> we can't all make RuPaul laugh. Sometimes our references are British. A British reference on Drag Race UK? I know. Who would do such a disgusting thing? <laughs> 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 um, uh, they go to the army camp and there's lots of like oh, motley. I just really enjoy Dishonor on you. Dishonor on your cow. cow. I love the cow. <laughs> I'd fuck the cow. Um, Where's the cow? It, it's the horse. She doesn't have a cow. Oh. You keep saying that the, cow is, the horse is a cow. Um, I was like, we've never seen a cow. I take things at face value. I take little dragon lizards at face value. Fair enough. Shoot me. <laughs> <laughs> right now. <laughs> Please. Please. Um, I'm, I'm obsessed with her walk as she goes into the camp. She tries to do her big mask walk and make herself really big. That's why I walk through tube stations at rush hour. <laughs> like, get out of my way. <laughs> um, Harvey Firestein, the aforementioned. Yes. Get spanked. She has a great line. They're disgusting. And she's like, no, they're men. <laughs> <laughs> this really shaped my outlook, honestly. <laughs> um, yeah, men are punching. Each- Why do men find punching each other funny? Like not, I, why is it a thing? The only instance where I will endorse straight men hurting each other. Is if you get to watch. Is if they start with a little kiss <laughs> and they get a chair. <laughs> sure. Have you not seen, have you seen? You've seen the lads with the chair. Yes, you've shown me the lads. The lads with the chair. With the chair. Yeah. It's such an interesting portrait of masculinity. It is, yes. Fascinating. Mm. Hang it in the Louvre. Honestly, so is Har- uh, Harvey Firestein playing Yao. 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 It's it's fascinating what he's doing there. <laughs> <laughs> Why uh, do we think of Harvey Firestein for this? He was famous for being a, a big fairy. But he's got the. Uh, 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 voice. Uh, 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 I'm never gonna catch my breath. Yeah. Um, uh, they all blame Mulan for ruining the dinner yes. queue. Um, they do, however, calm themselves down by practicing mindfulness, which I thought was very cute. Is it Chen Po who's yes. the nice, the nice uh, one? He's really sweet. The, who's like a big baby? Yes. Um, um, in a nearby tent, we meet. A hot new bombshell has entered <laughs> a nearby tent. Entered wherever he fancies. Oh, to be please. <laughs> oh, when I was in my adolescence. There I've just a... realised I'm no longer going with bisexual unless it's Mulan. <laughs> and then I'll bring it back. <laughs> um, when I was um, about 14, yeah, um, there was a deviant art account throwback. Didn't you break up with your first girlfriend on deviant art? I think it was on Facebook. But we were very we we basically dated on deviant art, okay. even though we went to the same school. Okay. Um, I'm really I'm sorry. I felt bad. I was closeted. What was her name? I'm not going to say that. Right. <laughs> we talked about Billy Crystal or whatever her fucking name was. Jamie Crystal. That's it. <laughs> and her limousine company. I'm trying to get like <laughs> another limousine ride off Jamie Crystal's dad. Fair enough. And that is what you think it means. Um, there was a deviant art that did like reimaginings of Disney princes oh, yeah? in sexy, sexy poses. Uh-huh. And the Lee Shang one was fucking fit. I mean, yeah. That one, Prince Naveen. Uh, Flynn Rider was alright I think he had a pierced nipple Oh uh, And David from Lilo and Stitch Not a prince But Prince of My Heart Is he just The boyfriend He's like Nanny's of... boyfriend Yeah Oh okay It was a very I'm gonna see if I, I can find the account I fancied her She's the Debbie I fancied Stitch Of um Sorry <laughs> Horse girl summer <laughs> <laughs> You look at that horse And you tell me You wouldn't fuck that horse I can't. <laughs> I know. I know you can't. It's a fuckable horse. Um, right. Lee Shang, here he is. He's made captain. He's a Nepo baby. He's a I fuck- never clocked that. <laughs> Nepo baby. Because, well, the, the guy is like, I made you a captain. And um, you're, you're great. You're fabulous. You're yep. an impressive lineage. And I was like, that's fit. This man wants to fuck him. Yeah. And then it's revealed that he's like, lol, his impressive dad. lineage. Just because it's his dad. Phil, that's a video you've watched. <laughs> And I do it again. Yeah. <laughs> I know. Uh, um, also, uh, he didn't sing a song yet, but Donny Osmond. Famous Chinese actor, <laughs> Donny Osmond. Yes. Uh, I think Mormon my fav- cult. I think my favourite thing about Donny Osmond is how much Trisha Paytas likes Donny Osmond. I mean, we've all seen the Joseph film. But I've have I not sent you the video of her going to a meet and greet dressed as... Oh, now who was she dressed as? Was it Joseph or I think did she, she was go dressed as, as Joseph. the Pharaoh? Because she... <laughs> that video. Either of way, her... it was probably problematic. Of her dressed 
in the Farah outfit and it's like probably problematic might delete later and she does an anniversary of it every year because she hasn't deleted it have you heard her her, her religious songs <laughs> i love you moses i love you jesus yeah yes of course moses has shaved his beard recently and it's very unsettling moses the biblical figure what? no wait do you not know right trisha Paytas did i love you jesus yeah and then she married Moses Hackman. Okay. And so she wrote, I love you, Moses, about him. Oh, I thought it was about... No, it's about her boyfriend. Her husband, sorry. Interesting. Yeah. I thought it was about the biblical figure Moses. No. She's, no. Be- she's well... Prince of Egypt. She was very in her, like, Trish, like, fish, Christian girl summer vibes. At that she's point. She's fascinating. I'm I'm so genuinely fascinated with her. She's in her wench era. Is she still in her wench era? No, she's not. More's oh. the pity. She is... I'm a obs- hello there, traveller. <laughs> the fairies, traveller. <laughs> Would you like to eat an apple? <laughs> we are already 45 minutes into this. I episode. don't give a fuck. I do it's because my doorbell fuck. keeps fucking ringing. Yeah. That's why. Uh, <laughs> uh, Lee Shang meets Mulan, who is now going by the name of Ping. Yes, I love. Uh, Mulan trying to freak, uh, freaking out, trying to think of what men would do. So like, kill things, fix things, cook outdoors. <laughs> the three genders. Yeah. Well, no, the one. The father, the son, and the Holy Spirit yeah. of masculinity. Mm-hmm. Um, I think the um, the sort of the sacred lamb of masculinity is ugly plaid shorts. You know those type, those specific shorts. Burton menswear. All men at some point get those shorts. Mm. You're right. Yeah, I said that once at a gig, and people looked at me blankly. I'm like, I'm right. <laughs> Why are you booing me? Yeah. I'm right. <laughs> people did not believe Jesus. <laughs> Apart from Trisha Paytas. Yes. Uh, 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 he knows Mulan's father, the war yes. hero. Mm-hmm. Um, Mushu wakes her up. With porridge with a smiley face and on it. it's happy to see you. <laughs> I've always wanted this porridge. I want someone to make me this porridge. <laughs> Got little eggs, egg eyes. Egg eyes and a bacon smile. <laughs> Would be horrible in porridge, personally. but um... Well, it's, um, it's like a savoury porridge, uh... I think. Um, Li Shang takes his top off. Why has he got an open shirt? And then he's like, oh, hang on. I've got to fire an arrow. Let me remove the open shirt because it was so very cumbersome. Why, why are you complaining? <laughs> I'm not. It's, I just it's, think it's, it's time for something, Caitlin. To get down to business. It's time to get back down to business. <laughs> to defeat the, the Huns. Huns. <laughs> um, uh, he makes him try and climb up a pole with some weights in his hands. Yes. Which right. I do in some stand-up. Do you? I talk about if I ask someone who they would, what celebrity they would fuck if they were a giant. Okay. And the answer is Dwayne The Rock Johnson. Um, uh-huh. And it's so you could do that bit in Mulan up his cock. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. It's an old, an old bit of stand-up, uh-huh. but I'm, I'm drip-feeding back in. Um, the weights represent discipline and strength. I think it represents taking the piss, but... <laughs> but... Like, I couldn't do that without the weight. They're like, oh yeah, I can do that without the weight. What? You can't get any purchase. You cannot get... No. On the, on the pole. I think unless I was... Like like an octopus and they had little suckers. Or if I had very sharp claws. Yeah. Yeah. Or a pickaxe. Mm-hmm. Um, and we get one of the best Disney songs. Yeah. Ever, in my opinion, personally. Did they send me daughters when I asked for sons? Training montage as well. You must be swift as a coasting river. Be a man. With all the points of a great time boom. Be a man. With all the strength of a raging fire. Mysterious mm. as the it's dark a- side of the moon. Banger. It's so good. I'm never going to catch my breath. <laughs> Say goodbye to those who knew me. <laughs> it's great. Why was I a fool at school for, for a cutting gym? gym. This guy's going to be scared, scared to death. death. Hope it doesn't see, see right through me. me. It's so good. It's so good. It's amazing. It's fantastic. I well love it. Well done. Put, put your feet bit... up and get the dildo out. Hen. Oh, Donny, <laughs> get it out. The bit where he's like, he's like, go home. Or what does he say? So pack up, go, go home, home, you're, you're through. through. How could I make, make a man out of you? you? Oh, so... Chills. <laughs> Chills. Yeah, so he sends Ping home, but... But Ping's like, no, I'm going to climb up that pole like Dwayne the Rock Johnson's cock. Yeah, <laughs> and gets to the top of it. Yes. Um, and becomes a great warrior. Yes. Well done. Um, Shan Yu. We also get oh. um, the Jet. Wait, what's his name? Donny Osmond. Li Shang? That's it. Um, uh, is I think that's where we get the start of him 
looking at Mulan like, oh, well, am a... I bi? You're bi. <laughs> <laughs> there's a bit where he grabs the shirt. Yeah. And then it's, it's like a little glance down, apparently. I couldn't see ah. it when I watched it, but... It's fit. I don't know. Um, Shan Yu is sniffing a doll. Little freak. Little freak. Um, his hawk brought a little doll and he's like, the army is waiting in the mountains. Somehow he knows that. It's very sinister when he's like, the little girl will be missing her doll. You must mm. return it to her. Very sinister. Uh, Mulan gets all naked in the lake. I personally wouldn't do that if I was trying to hide my sex. I wouldn't either, but I'm happy for it. I probably it. wouldn't do that anyway. <laughs> um, yeah. you'll, never, you'll never see me naked. No. <laughs> Um, and um, all the guys, Ling, Yao, Yao and Chimpo, run to the pond. And Mushu bites Ling and immediately starts brushing his teeth. It's very funny. They have like a bonding moment yeah. where they're all naked in the lake. Yes. And they don't clock on. Not a soul can clock. <laughs> uh, and Mulan's like, oh, I hope I never have to see another naked man. <laughs> and then a whole Me as fuck. Jumanji stampede. <laughs> Honestly. Great. Mm-hmm. Uh, the Emperor's aide. The faggot one yes. um, tells Li Shang that um, he's berating yeah, him. He's like, "This trip is shit." And but then, to be fair, he's like, "They're not ready for battle," and he's like, "Yes, they are. Send them to be killed." Like he's just he's trying to be like, "I'm great at this," but if they're not ready, they're just gonna die. I think it's kind yeah. of reasonable. The aide's like, "Send them home. They're all shit." And I'm like, yeah. "Okay, so Mulan's dad could have come." Yeah. They just been sent straight home. Actually, yeah. <laughs> Super fine. Because, yeah. <laughs> we could have avoided all this. What was the point of any of this, bitch? Like. <laughs> If she had to fight for the country, she was ready to do so. <laughs> um, but Ping tells Li Shang that he's a great captain. Yes. And Mushu senses some chemistry. Mm-hmm. Um, Mushu and Kriki disguise themselves. <laughs> On as, a panda. <laughs> as a military official. Yes. Somehow. And tell the captain that they're needed for war, which is stupid. Mm-hmm. I'd be like, oh, thank God we can go home. Yeah. Lovely. Exactly. And then we get another banging song. A girl worth fighting for. It's not my favourite one. What? I'm sorry. It's great. It's fantastic. This is the last song of the film as well. Is it? Yeah. Wow. Until True to Your Heart in the credits. Uh, true to your heart. Must I be love True to your heart. Yao is like, oh, my girl will think I have no faults, that I'm a major find. And I was like, oh, it's Simone Biles' husband. <laughs> What's he done? Are you not? No. Oh my, oh my God. This episode's going to be nine years long. Fucking months ago, sorry. Fucking months ago, he... He was doing an interview with her and they were like, oh my God, don't you feel so lucky to be the wife of Simone Biles? And he's like, well, actually she approached me. I am I think I'm a catch. He's a fucking freak. I don't care for that. No. You, you, you're lucky. He's a little weirdo. And then uh, Mulan is like, what about a girl who uh, is really intelligent and always speaks her mind? No. <laughs> I'm Mulan's type. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> um, they get to the mountains. Yes. And it's been ransacked. That doll is there. That kid's dead. And so... It's so dead. ...is Li Shang's dad. And I, I always used to get very upset at this bit. He takes his dad's helmet and he takes <laughs> his sword and magic happens. No. <laughs> and he sticks a sword in the ground and he puts the helmet on top and then he just leaves it there. What Free you, sword. What are you going to fight with? This seems foolhardy. Free accessories. Ooh, yeah. Um, Mushu accidentally gives away their position by lighting a cannon. Um, I hate this fucking dragon. <laughs> fuck this dragon. Yes. But not in the same way that you'd fuck the horse. No. Um, and uh, loads of the Hun's arrows come flying at them. Yeah, there's a big um, battle. They fire cannons back at them. There's tra- I like these, these like sweeping shots. It's gorgeous. This is I, I felt genuinely tense. It feels very cinematic, yes. which is good because it's a film. Yeah. <laughs> um, um, and Ping uses the last cannon to cause an avalanche. Yes. Which buries all the Huns. Yes. Um, but Shan Yu gets a little sword stabby in yes. at the last moment. Oh, and there's a great... Um, the bit where Ping is riding the horse through the snow. Mm. Ah, it's beautiful. Um, yeah, they almost fall off the mountain. Yes. But the whole gang rallies together to grab them and pull them up. Yes. Even the horse. They're strong enough to lift a horse. Yes. Thank God, because that horse needs a fucking... <laughs> they call the doctor. Oh no, Mulan's been binding. Yeah, he walks into the tent and he's like, Tits! Not tits! Oh! I only fancied you when you were a boy! <laughs> oh! <No>! Uh, <laughs> everyone's fuming and they're really yeah. annoyed. And you think he's um, going to kill her. Yeah! 
he gets very angry and then he's like no you saved my life so i'm repaying the debt um he still leaves her in the snow without any clothes good as killed her that's like taking negging too far isn't it yes <laughs> yeah to abuse <laughs> Yeah. Uh, and Mulan's like lamenting a situation. It's like maybe I didn't actually go for my father. Uh huh. Uh huh. Do you want to <laughs> think more? <laughs> Mulan's therapist, like, yes, <laughs> we've been through this. <laughs> and why do you think you cut off all your hair and started binding? Was it for your dad? And started hanging out with all the guys. <laughs> <laughs> um, Mushu tells Mulan that he's not the big great dragon. And Cricky's also like, I'm not even that lucky. <laughs> you have to grab one through traffic. Yes. Um, oh, the nasty the... hawk has arrived. Oh, I was going to say, that's a really sad bitch. That maybe I wanted to look in the mirror and see something worthwhile. You're trans. You're trans. <laughs> you are trans. You are tr- you're trans. Uh, the um, nasty hawk has arrived. Yes. And so has Shan Yu who survived. Oh, no. Oh, no. Um, but Mulan sees this. Yes. Um, and and she... conveniently, they're right next to the city. <laughs> like she looks down, she's like, "Oh, there it is." <laughs> um, it's the homecoming celebrations. Yes. Um, and she's like, "I need to go and interrupt this, even mm-hmm. though I'm disgraced." Yes. Um, and Shang's like, "You don't belong here." And she's like, she's like, "The Huns are in the city." And he's like, "I don't give a fuck. <laughs> You've got tits." <laughs> <laughs> Come back, we don't have tits. She's like, "I'm working on she, it." <laughs> it's expensive. It's expensive. Donate got... to my GoFundMe. GoFundMe. <laughs> Um, uh, Li Shang presents Shan Yu's sword to the emperor. Yes. But it's grabbed by and the, the nasty fit hawk. Snaps it, yes. Like a seagull. And the Huns burst out the dragon. Yeah. It's exciting. Deception. Trojan yeah. horse. Trojan, I was thinking that, yeah. Trojan dragon. Trojan dragon. Um, Chinese dragon. <laughs> that's a thing. Yeah. We've gone full circle. <laughs> uh, they take the emperor and they lock themselves yes. in the palace. And the army tries to use a statue as a battering ram. <laughs> they this massive statue yeah. and they're just like, Bang. <laughs> Bang. Yes. Bang. And Mulan's like, yeah, I've got the answer is cross dressing. This week, three friends need to get into quick drag, scale the palace with ribbons, <laughs> and use fruit tits to disarm your enemy. <laughs> and don't fuck it up. <laughs> with delicious bubbly sparkling water. <laughs> with delicious Miss Mandarins. <laughs> <laughs> Why hi <are you> there? <laughs> It's great. They should be up to the roof as yeah. sexy ladies. Yes. Um, I think they, for quick drag, it's pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> maybe it wasn't. Maybe it was like hours. <laughs> and they're like, the what? emperor's like bleeding out. We've got to do it right. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Mushu burns the feathers off the nasty hawk and yes. makes it like a little turkey. <laughs> it's not a fuckable hawk anymore. <laughs> um, and they managed to make it onto the roof and rescue the emperor. Yes. But Shan Yu bonks Li Shang on the head real bad. Yeah, he's like, you took away my victory. And then Mulan's like, no, I did. (laughs) Um, And Shan Yu gives gives chase. Chases Mulan up to like the top of the roof. How flimsy are these fucking walls? He's like punching through walls. At one point he jumps upwards through the ceiling. Maybe he's just fit. Maybe he's just really fit. (laughs) (laughs) Um, They face up. Also, sorry. We haven't talked about how fabulous his nails are. What shall you? Yeah, he went in and asked for like a stiletto nail in ballet slipper. <laughs> they were out of ballet slipper. Sorry, took the last one. <laughs> Lady Gaga. <laughs> okay, I imagine so. But it's it's like he's got lovely little manicure claws. Got no nails on. Don't. He's gay. <laughs> he's a drag king. He's better drag than he's me. A drag king. <laughs> yeah, if you're not wearing nails. Fair enough. They're cumbersome. You could still finger someone. Yeah. With peace of mind. <laughs> <laughs> um, she uses a fan to steal his sword. Yes. Um, and then Mushu and Creaky arrive with a, on a firework. Yeah. And impale him. Yes. On a it's firework. Quite a horrible way to go. Really horrible. Yeah. Yeah. But to be fair, he did murder loads of people. Loads. But he was quite fit while he did it. So where do I stand on this? <laughs> It's a grey area. Yeah. It's a gay area. Yeah. Um, the Emperor tells Mulan off, but he's very grateful for being saved, thanks. Yeah. And there's also a bit where he's like, oh, you're a hero. And the assistant's like, she's a woman. She'll never be anything. I mean, 
she'll be trans. Mm-hmm. Um, and he wants to put Mulan on his council, the emperor. She turns it down for like going home and having a nap. Fair enough. <laughs> Fair enough, babe. <laughs> put your feet up. Get, get the, the dildo, dildo out. out. You've saved China. <laughs> She gets a nice medal and she gets to keep the sword. And all of all of the city bows to her. And everyone hugs her. All, yeah. all of her friends, the, her, her war friends. Mm-hmm. Um, and Li Sheng absolutely fumbles it with her. Yeah. And the emperor's like, you don't miss, you don't meet a girl like that every dynasty. Funny. Yeah. Um, Mulan goes home and shows her dad all of her trinkets. Yes. But he's just glad to have her back. He says, the greatest gift and honour is having you for a daughter. Aww. And she's like, well, update on that. <laughs> <laughs> I have news. <laughs> I've discovered some things being around the boys. <laughs> um, Violence, one of the boys. Um, Li Shang arrives with Mulan's helmet. Uh, <laughs> and the mum's like, would you like to stay for dinner? <laughs> the like, would you like to stay, stay forever? forever? <laughs> it's great. And um, yeah. Mushu gets to be a guardian. He gets upgraded or whatever. He gets to be a yeah. guardian again. They have a little disco. Yes, I love, I love true this True to your heart. Must be true to your heart. Da, 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 da. And that's that's it. That's that on that. And then Christina does reflection. Yes. <laughs> Where's that girl I see? No. You'll never be Leia so longer. You'll never be Leia so longer. We can't all be. Where do you stand on the Christina Pink beef? <laughs> Rare or medium? Welcome to the stage, <laughs> Christina Pink beef. <laughs> um. Uh, what was the Christina Pink beef? Oh, the, they just had loads of beef in the 2000s. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to get rid gout. of it. <laughs> <laughs> um, they just, I think they just fought over who should be the main one in like Moulin Rouge and who, you know. Oh, Christina. I mean, yeah, but I'm also team pink because she, I thought she was gay. I do like, but she's got short She's hair. not gay. And she but... does a lot of aerial stunts. You, oh, you'd be forgiven. Didn't she get really offended because someone was like. You gay or something? No, I think. You got a boner? Uh, something like not this but someone was like oh Morgan McMichaels looks like pink and she's like how dare you oh but so maybe, maybe Morgan maybe. did bad in that snatch game so yeah it wasn't Morgan it was like, but also Christina isn't Christina a bit of a wrong one I don't know Gwen Stefani yes major wrong one at the time yes right my brain has done lots of hop skips and, and also jumps. a bit Avril Lavigne was a bit of a wrong one but well that's where that's because she's a cyborg that's where I hop skipped and jumped to mm. Um, do you know why Avril Lavigne did that song, Hello Kitty? Why? Because Avril Lavigne is massive in Japan. Oh. And like, it was, it was made for her by the, like the Japanese tourist board or something. Oh. But it's also her song that's been translated into multiple different countries because those l- languages, because those people went, it's a bit weird that you did this Hello Kitty song for Japan. And so to legitimize it, it's now in like Bulgarian and shit. She's like, No. It's just a song because I really like Hello Kitty. It's like, no one's falling for that, babe. I did get the Hello Kitty grind coffee tin. <gasps> of course you did. It's gorgeous. And yeah. Jamie Windust. Yes. And it also reminds me of the SNL Hello Kitty sketch. I don't know that. It's Kiki Palmer and Bowen Yang. And a great combo. they're working at Hello Kitty. And uh-huh. they just... Because the Hello Kitty lore is uh-huh. insane. She's not a kitty. She's, She's a, a girl. real girl. She's a little girl. Yeah. <laughs> yeah like, they talk about... But like her boyfriend is, is a cat. And oh, and she, suddenly if I want to fuck the horse, I'm the problem. She's All measured right. in apples. Um, what? Like she's three apples tall. <laughs> and Kiki Paul was like, what the fuck is this? And then she goes, she's like, All right then, what's her race? <laughs> and they're like, we're, we're not comfortable asking that. It's like, what's her race? <laughs> and she's like, you're telling me this five-year-old girl is fucking this cat bareback, but you won't tell me her race. <laughs> Say she's black. <laughs> it's great. It's great. I'd recommend okay. it. Okay. Uh, so every time I have a coffee, I'm like, what's her race? <laughs> race? <laughs> Peppermint? A little black person? <laughs> it's great. Um, right. I'm getting hungry. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Should we wrap this up? And have a wrap. And take it to go. H-O-T-T-O-G-O. I'm seeing her in September. I want to. Well, they released new dates. They have. Yeah. Mine got moved. Yeah, she's busy. Doing what? All stars. <laughs> Imagine. Mean, she's just fast tracked straight to all stars. Yeah. Um, have I just got lips from my nose? 
from doing that? No. Good. Um, <laughs> uh, was it was it queer? <laughs> Did it, we answered the question. I we reckon need, so. We can't hold your hand through everything. <laughs> it's it, gay. It made us gay. It's trans. I watched it a lot. And I'm only recently catching up to a lot of the ideas <laughs> and it. It breadcrumbed for me. <laughs> Mulan and Raquel. We learned a lot about you today. Who's Raquel? Oh, yeah, Raquel. <laughs> Raquel. <laughs> yeah. I got you some thinking. <laughs> um, thank you for listening. Yes. Uh, if you enjoyed this, uh, you can follow us at Queers Gone By and all the things. I'm at Kate, the Kate Butch. Yes, I'm at a Caitlin Powell. A Caitlin Powell. A Caitlin Powell. The three, Egan. Um, uh, you can subscribe wherever you get your podcasts. Tell a friend. Tell an enemy. T- tell Miriam. Tell well to, uh, to be fair, Miriam. To be fair, you knocked it out of the park. Smashed it, babe. Smashed through that door. Now get back to work. Bush on fire. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, we mentioned the Patreon. Uh, this was yes. chosen by them, so you can find us at patreon.com forward slash queers because we have mm-hmm. polls occasionally. We have a big thread where you can just suggest stuff. Yes. Um, to put in our little oh, bank actually, of. I was thinking we should probably at some point say who. Well, maybe they don't want to. We don't want to out anyone. Oh, that's true. We don't have to do full... We don't have to do government names. <laughs> we will. And national insurance numbers. Yeah. yeah. And your mother's maiden name. <laughs> Please. <laughs> um, but you can um, just, yeah, tell, spread the word. Leave a review and a rating. Please. Um, Someone gave us a three-star review. We know their national insurance. Remove number. the review. <laughs> <laughs> Remove it. <laughs> Um, what should we do until next week? I don't know. We're be fucking a horse. Well, you fuck that penguin. <laughs> <laughs> Who's back? We called it. Yeah. Um, should we? Yeah. Yeah. Keep fucking that horse. <laughs> fucking up that horse. Um, we'll see you next week. And until then, <laughs> keep, keep fucking, fucking that, that horse. horse. You would. That horse specifically. Oh yeah, not, I'm not advocating for bestiality. I'm not a monster. <laughs> that horse is dead. Wow. How long do horses live? Probably not thousands of years. <laughs> and also probably not if they're in the army, not very long. No, that no. horse is glue. How's my wig doing? I use that horse to glue this down <laughs> and it's coming unstuck, so we're going to stop now. <laughs> it's a very old horse. It's a very old horse. It's a very old horse. <laughs> Bye-bye. Bye. <laughs>